take me through what this year has been like for you? Roller coaster. Ups and downs, um, emotionally, physically. I think there's uh, a lot of life lessons learned this year, not only by myself, but by um, staff and players alone, or, uh, all together. I mean, um, you know, hockey's a, a, a job for us, and I think I put it in perspective this year. And I think we played better because we realized that um, you know, life happens and make the most of your opportunity when, when you and you have a group that we all cared about so much together in this room. Uh, you know, and it makes you play a little bit better and care about more, care about each other a little bit more. Nicole tweeted at the end about what a year it's been. I guess what did she say to you when you guys finally talked after Pittsburgh? Um, you know, it's uh, enjoy, enjoy the run, enjoy the moment. Um, you know, and, and come home. I think we always grow as, as uh, players. Um, you know, when, when you go through adversity, it's not, not what happens to you, but it's how you react. And I think uh, we all responded in the right way. I think uh, I was able to, to use hockey and, and use you know, my teammates as, as, a, as a source to, to get away from, from personal life. And uh, have a you know a three-hour moment of, of peace. You know when you're when I'm, you're on the ice and there's nothing in the world but that puck and, and you're competing. Um, you're at peace. You have, you have nothing to worry about. And, uh, that was the three hours that I had. And then you go back to life right after. In October, when she told you to go join your teammates, was your initial reaction to say no, no, no? Absolutely. <laughs> Um, yeah, I mean, I wanted to stay with her. You know, the unknown. It was, we didn't know what the extent of anything was. So, you know, it, the cancer, you know, was life-threatening, and, and she had three months to live. And I would have felt horrible going back. But the way it kind of worked out, we didn't know. There was still a lot of unknown and the timing of it. But um, you know, she insisted that I go back. But, uh, my family, my hockey family, needed me. And, and that, uh, she had her family. But I didn't want to go out there. We, uh, we, you know, we were in Pennsylvania with her family, so she had her family. She had some support, so uh, which which was huge. That allowed me to go back. What's the, is there an update? How she's doing? Uh, yeah, we um, she did a PET scan and uh, MRIs and stuff, and as of right now, um, everything's clean, and we'll just cross our fingers for. Uh, we got to do scans. I think every three months. So, uh, as of right now. Things are positive, but um, you know, you're not out of the woods yet until you get, I think, two years of, of cancer-free news. Probably not.